We carved our lands from the hoods they put us in. Rolled up our sleeves, headed west, and called it manifested destiny, dressed up a blackface god. My god. Recovered the entire nativity. Got Jesus rocking them robes and black locks. Took the frankincense and the myrrh and crafted idols out of money and status, but not the gold. No. No gold at all. No chains. No grills, no rings without a college seal, nothing no one could ever mistake as a gun. We buried these treasures with the dead. They were underground kings. But we, we are the children of tomorrow. Only hope, only dreams. We preached peace, teach kids to speak in whole words and complex sentences built mansions like temples and chased out the dope veins and the gangbangers with a whip flipped the bandos into condominiums. We carved our lands out of the hoods they put us in and claimed ourselves free of niggas. But when I found out that we was niggas too, or the day Connor called Jonathan a nigger at the predominantly white Southern Christian private school I went to, I no longer knew which God to pray to. My God, our parents tried to give us joy. They fashioned a feast out of the scraps of land no longer coveted by mortal men, all while our brothers starved at our doorstep, grabbing for a dollar or a morsel of pity each time we tread out the house over their outstretched hands, and I wonder, how I'm supposed to get to heaven, weighed down with all this black grief. Wonder how I ever saw the holiness inside of me covered in all this black skin. Could God forgive us for claiming the land, for turning cheek and heel? Could anything heal the scar we carved across the hood, claimed Cascade and College Park? Once, Murphy went to a party in the West and introduced himself, and they say, why he talk white and shit? Why he speak with whole words like he ain't broke too, like he ain't from the block too, trapped too, like he ain't get his kicks on Bankhead with the rest of them. Murphy Spawn says, aren't I black too? Are you not my brother? never knowing if it was by birth or simply foster care. They call us Uncle Toms and bougie. We call it educated. We call them hood rats and jigaboos. They call it survival. So now I wonder, do we truly live under the same sky? Do we speak the same language with the same tongue? Or are our similarities only skin deep? <laughs>